tomorrow we're going to be getting the brand new bandit troop in squad busters yes the troop that spawns a ton of gems is coming and today i'll be giving you all the information on how you can unlock it how long the event's going to last for and what the best squad is going to be with the bandit okay so we're going to be getting the bandit on the 18th of july which is literally tomorrow and the event will last until the 28th of july so it's going to last for 10 days so what's going to happen tomorrow is you can see here there is going to be a bandit in your plaza so just like the ice event that we would recently had and i'm gonna be honest unlocking the bandit it looks quite free to play friendly I i'm gonna be real with you option number one is you pay fifty thousand gold and you immediately get the bandit which by the way is half the price of normally unlocking a new troop so i don't know why they made it cheaper to unlock this brand new troop than an old troop which is good by the way it's not a bad thing or you can just collect 50 gem pouches from battle to unlock the bandit for free so for every 100 gems you collect in battle you will get one gem pouch so five thousand gems and you unlock the bandit that's really not hard you've got 10 days to get 5,000 gems i think you'll all do that even if you play the game like twice a day you'll still get that done so this bandit is only going to be unlockable during the event it's not going to be in a world just yet i'm sure it'll get added eventually but we'll have more information on that later and when the bandit comes out tomorrow i will be live streaming myself buying it and then maxing it out straight away so if you want to watch that then tune in tomorrow for my live stream and you know what let's get into some games now okay so we're going to be on troublesome gulch chest imposters and we are on loot goblin rush oh these are some pretty interesting modifiers anyways so the bandit is obviously coming out tomorrow and i'm gonna be honest do i think this is gonna be one of the best troops in the game yes i think it is because not only do you get a bunch and i mean a bunch of gems when it spawns in but it also gives you the ability to spawn in extra gems for every monster you kill so for every big monster you kill the game will give you an extra one gem and if you max out the bandit it'll give you an extra two gems now that doesn't seem like a big deal but for every big monster that you kill getting an extra two gems i mean that adds up and also all the gems you get when it spawns in i reckon this bandit is going to be stupidly op so now my opinion is this bandit will be good in squads that have high dps because you're going to want to go for monsters you're not going to want to farm you're not going to want a farming squad that's my guess i think you're going to want a squad that has high dps so you can be killing as many monsters as you can in middle and literally just you know get a bunch of gems let's get a pam right now i was tempted to go for a heavy i went for a pam because it doesn't do bad damage. What is Camden doing? Hold up. Is that a bot? Okay, I don't know what Camden is doing, but he's definitely about to die. And I'm actually really weak myself, so I need to be careful. Let's sit in the healing. Let's take out this stupid little big uh, thing that he spawned in. The Mega Crab, aka one of the worst troops in the game. So yeah, I do think Bandit is going to be a top tier troop. Now, when the update drops tomorrow, what I'm going to do is that I'm going to live stream it. But the way I'm going to do it is I'm not going to max it out instantly. I think I will buy the Bandit. I'll use it at baby. And then I think I'm going to upgrade it to super super which is the third tier and once it hits third tier i'm gonna then play a battle so you can see how good a super bandit is and then we'll max out the bandit and see well how good it is even more so i'm gonna do it in stages i think that'll be a lot better for you guys because you can see more free to play friendly levels rather than just a maxed out bandit straight away uh, let's get a penny for the loot we are doing pretty well this game 89 gems let's take out this golem uh it's a goblin <laughs> Also, I've recently won a $5,000 Squad Busters tournament. Some of you guys might know this, but yesterday, well, actually, it was today. It was like 2 a.m. for me. But I have won a Squad Busters tournament for $5,000. And because of that, I get $5,000 in Samson Galaxy prizes to give away to you guys. I will have a video on that very soon, so don't worry for everybody who's wondering. And there's a guy here who I'm actually going to go for real quick. Okay, what the heck was that? That guy was weak. All right, we got a real player here. Let's go for him. And he immediately ran away. Okay, cool. Let's throw some turrets down, get the these trees tree number one tree number two i just realized this goblin rush i should be trying to get a um oh no oh, i need an ice wizard game give me an ice wizard ice wizard yes check this out this is the strategy i throw an ice spell in mid and now we get a bunch of coins look at this we have 500 coins wow that was op all right you see the strat there the ice spell is so op in this modifier it really is broken i'm actually gonna try get some kills real quick another ice wizard uh let's get a barbarian king and let's go for a fight i want to fight this guy real quick let's just go for him let's make sure he can't run away take out some of his troops there's another couple people here let's go for them both this ice wizard is so broken with its fan ability oh we are cooking let's re-roll and get another right why did i even re-roll there's like 20 seconds left. that was not smart let's drop a spell on him and take out some of his troops he's running away i don't really actually care let's get another penny 15 seconds left we probably won the game uh he actually did a little bit of damage but i still feel like i'm more op no i'm not okay <laughs> 
<laughs> I run away. <laughs> yeah, I wasn't a really good ad. I don't really cook there, but yeah, the game over. And again, I just want to remind everybody, I will be live streaming the update tomorrow, okay? So hang around my channel when the update goes live, and I'll be streaming shortly after, and I'll see you guys then. Goodbye.